After more than a month's adjournment of the debate on the estimates of expenditure, parliamentarians returned to the House on Tuesday, June 20th, but it was not long before there was yet another exit by opposition MPs. The House resumed the debate with MP for Library Alva Baptiste's presentation. When he sat, no other parliamentarian rose to speak. MP for Mikut South and leader of the House majority, Alan Chastney, then rose to present his rebuttal. It was at that time opposition MPs stood and left the chamber. A press conference was held immediately after. Mr. Pierre, the leader of the opposition, explained the reason for their action. The Prime Minister, in his normal, vindictive and spiteful manner, because he has the power of rebuttal, refuses to allow four senior members of his government to speak. You must understand, Stevenson King was a former Prime Minister. He holds an important portfolio of infrastructure and ports. We wanted to hear from Mr. King what was the state of the grocery highway. What was the state of the Hiwanora Airport? The Prime Minister did not allow Stevenson King to speak. Ezekiel Joseph, who is in effect the Deputy Prime Minister, has the important portfolio of agriculture. We wanted to hear from Ezekiel Joseph. What's the plight of the banana farmers? What's the plight of the marketing board? What's the plight of the Fish and Marketing Corporation? He did not allow Ezekiel Joseph to speak. Mr. Pierce said also his side had wished to hear from MP Leonard Motut on the NICE program as well as issues regarding sports and the fact that very little attention was given to sports in the estimates. The Prime Minister, in a spiteful and vindictive manner, closes the budget and begins a, a, a charade of lies, of innuendos, of threats, of insults against the members of the SLP. We will not allow the Prime Minister to run roughshod over us. For his part, Mr. Chastney has dismissed the walkout and says the people's business must go on. The next step in the budgetary process entails debate in the Senate on the Appropriations Bill. The St. Lucia Labour Party has announced its senators will be absent. Eliza Victor, GVD News.